My name is Noel Cunningham and welcome to my Donegal. Maybe for this purpose, my South Donegal, where I was born and bred, down by the ocean, the wild Atlantic just a stone's throw away. I leave the beautiful Harvey's Point and Loch Esk in the background, and I can drive down little roads that the Americans sort of still call boreens. And boreens they are, and lovely wildflowers and blackthorn, and of course our fuchsia. And people are amazed that they don't see the fuchsia anywhere but in Ireland, and especially in Donegal. Those splashes of bright red on the side of a hill or a mountain or by a lake, they're absolutely stunning. Here at Harvey's Point, we're only a couple of kilometres from beautiful town of Donegal, an old heritage town steeped in history and it really is a charming place to wander about in. For example, McGee of Donegal, they sit there proudly on the diamond and McGee of Donegal for hundreds of years provided employment and not only that, created some of the great beautiful tweeds and fabrics that went worldwide. To this day, the great fashion houses use McGee tweed. And in fact, in the old days, some of my own family would have had visits from the executives in McGee's, and they would collect uh, wool that had been spun in private houses on spinning wheels to make tweed. And that is how employment was created, and that was about the contribution that McGee made to this part of Donegal. And then, of course, the castle, sitting proudly, and the, the lovely magical romance of Red Hugh O'Donnell and the flight of the earls. It's all there in the walls of that beautiful building. And then if you stroll down from the castle, there's the Four Masters bookshop, full of a whole treasure of books. And of course, we're very famous for books and for sort of poetry and music and art. You know, think Brian Friel, you know, uh, I mean, just we're steeped in it. The Donegal fiddlers, for example, steeped in that tradition as well. And then right there on the diamond, opposite the Four Masters bookshop, is that monument to the Four Masters. These were people who traveled Europe and wrote gospels in fabulous hand. And actually, like, like the great monks in that other day, they brought education beyond our shores and, and educated people all over the world. Now, Donegal is very special. The town is special. And you can stroll down to the water bus, go out on the water bus for a trip round the bay, visit the seal colony, see the beautiful shoreline from the ocean. And it's just peaceful and it's just beautiful and it's just magical. Shops, restaurants, bars in abundance. All around the town, there they are, welcoming you in, a story to tell. Great food, traditional food, locally sourced food, very important, that grows in our fields by the sea. And indeed, if you want to wander outside of the town, maybe take a trip down towards Leave League, you'll see sheep. And you know, as far away as France, on a menu, you'll find that they have lamb on the menu and they call it agneau prisal. What does that mean? It means it's lamb that's raised by the sea in Donegal and the meat, you taste the salt water because they graze on land that's full of the salt water that comes in in the spray from the wild ocean, the wild Atlantic way. And of course, our bay full of boats, fishing for the angler, for the serious fishermen, they now look for tuna. They go out tuna fishing with under license and it's just everything that you could think of combined in this beautiful county and Donegal town is the base you can see the rest of the county at your ease over a period of time by just planning your arterial routes north south east and west every day that you stay in our beautiful town of Donegal.